opposite to the declaration of the open access to scientific information, which got wide support from the academic community. Now I'm in the city of Zadar, which is on the Adri Adriatic coast. As a researcher, I have often problems with the access to scientific information. But as a citizen, I have even more problems with accessing some coastal parts of our sea. So thanks to the creation of open access movement, thanks to Yadranka today, I can access a huge amount of information and I can even access our coast and this beautiful beach. Thank you, Yadranka. The University of Zadar is lately investing a lot of time and effort in changing attitudes of researchers and building the necessary infrastructure for storing and archiving research data and research publications. We have huge plans for the next year. So I would be interested, Yadranka, what are the future plans for Federation Open Access? What we would like that this uh, acceptance of the declaration of the Open Access in Croatia will motivate uh, creation of the Open Access repositories across all academic and research institutions in Croatia. Uh, last uh, week we had a nice promotion of the repository of the Ruja Boskovic Institute in Zagreb. But what I find very important is that we are not alone. We are part of the Open Air Plus project and this support from the European academic community is very important for such a small country as Croatia. And what I'm looking for is into the moment when all data about research in Croatia will be available to all European and world research and academic 